PLTR has more than doubled in the past six months, going from a price of about $6 to the current $14. This move has drawn a lot of attention towards the stock as more and more investors line up to buy. So is PLTR the best stock to buy for 2023? Keep watching as we answer that question by going through recent news as well as an in-depth analysis. But before we do that, subscribe to our channel, $1 World, for regular penny stock updates. Palantir Technologies Incorporated is a software company specializing in big data analytics. It was founded in 2003 by Peter Thiel, Nathan Gettings, Joe Lonsdale, Stephen Cohen, and Alex Karp. The company derives its name from the fictional seeing stones in J.R.R. Tolkien's The Lord of the Rings. Palantir software is designed to help organizations make sense of vast amounts of data. It has diverse applications across various sectors including government, commercial, healthcare, and financial services. In the government sector, Palantir software is utilized by intelligence agencies, law enforcement, and other government entities to track and analyze data related to terrorists, criminals, and other potential threats. This enables them to identify patterns, uncover connections, and make informed decisions to enhance national security. In the commercial sector, businesses leverage Palantir software to optimize their operations, improve decision-making processes, and identify new opportunities. By integrating and analyzing data from multiple sources, organizations can gain valuable insights that drive efficiency, innovation, and growth. Within the healthcare industry, Palantir software aids healthcare organizations in improving patient care, managing costs, and preventing fraud. By analyzing medical records, clinical data, and other relevant information, healthcare providers can enhance treatment outcomes, streamline processes, and ensure regulatory compliance. Financial institutions also benefit from Palantir software, which helps detect and prevent fraud, manage risk, and make better informed investment decisions. By analyzing vast data sets and identifying patterns, anomalies, and potential risks, financial services companies can safeguard against fraudulent activities, optimize their risk management strategies, and improve overall performance. Palantir's comprehensive suite of software solutions has made it a prominent player in the field of big data analytics, serving a wide range of industries. Its ability to handle and interpret large volumes of data has garnered attention and recognition, positioning Palantir as a key player in the data analytics industry. Now let's take a look at how the PLTR stock is performing on the market. Palantir Technologies Incorporated closed trading at $14.03 on Friday, June 23rd, down negative 0.14% from the previous day's close. Looking at the stock, we can see that its latest check on the previous day was $14.05 and its 5Y monthly beta was 2.79. With its price ranging from $13.56 and $14.14 .14 on the day. According to the stock's 52 week price range, PLTR attained a high price of $17.16 and a low price of $5.84 over that time period. Over the last month, the stock has increased in value by 11%. Palantir Technologies will report its quarterly results from August 7, 2023 to August 11, 2023, with a current market valuation of $30.25 billion. Analysts predict the company's profits in the current quarter to be $0.05 cents per share, with annual EPS growth increasing to $0.21 cents in 2023, with forecasts increasing to $0.25 cents in the following year. According to these forecasts, EPS will rise by 250% this year and 19% next year. Analysts who closely track the company's performance have provided sales predictions, estimating an average revenue of $530.63 million. Their projections indicate that the corporation can generate revenue as low as $529.1 million or as high as $531.98 million during this period. The average forecast reflects a substantial growth rate of 12.20% compared to the revenue reported by the firm in the same quarter last year. Furthermore, based on consensus estimates from analysts, the company is expected to achieve $2.21 billion in annual revenue in 2023, representing a significant increase of 15.90% compared to the revenue generated in the previous year. Analysts came revising their thoughts about the stock's EPS in the previous seven days, with no upward or lower revisions, a sign that might offer a clearer picture about the company's short-term price movement. When we look at the present prognosis for the PLTR stock, we see that short-term indicators have assigned it an average of 50% buy, while medium-term indicators have assigned it an average of 100% buy. Long-term indicators point to a buy recommendation of 100%. According to 17 analyst recommendations on a scale of 1 to 5, with 1 indicating a strong buy and 5 indicating a strong sell, 7 rate Palantir Technologies as a hold, while 2 believe the company is a buy. The stock has an underweight recommendation from 2 analysts, an overweight recommendation from 1 analyst, and a sell recommendation from 5 analysts. 
When taken as a whole, the stock has an overweight rating, which urges investors to capitalize on the opportunity and increase their ownership in the firm. Further investigation reveals the PLTR stock's peg ratio, which is now set at zero. It also states that the stock's current price is down 5.76% below its 20-day simple moving average and 23.84% below its SMA50. Its 14-period relative strength index is fluctuating at 51.40, while volatility stayed at 6.43% during the last week, rising to 7.34% when measured over the past month. Average true range is now at 1.01. Analysts expect price goals as low as $5 and as high as $18 for the company over the next 12 months, with an average price target of $10.21. The stock's present price level is 64.36% higher than the projected low price goal, but is down 28.3% lower than the estimated high. And even if PLTR's share managed to achieve the median price of $8.25, the outlook of 41.2% may pique the interests of investors. A closer look into Palantir Technologies reveals that the stock's average daily trading volume during the last three months was 68.42 million, but it increased to 94.72 million when we compute an average volume over the last 10 days. The total number of outstanding shares is 2.11 billion. The proportion of outstanding shares held by insiders is 0.60%, while institutional holders hold 34.90%. According to the numbers, the number of stock short shares as of May 30th, 2023 was 148.36 million, implying a short ratio of 1.56. On the day, there is a 7% short interest in the company's outstanding shares. The number of shares outstanding was 123.52 million in May, up from 123.52 million in the previous month. The addition of 118.54% by the company's current price to its year-to-date value in the latest trading session is expected to increase investor interest in the stock, indicating a sustained uptrend. Several institutional investors and hedge funds have lately changed their PLTR holdings. Close Asset Management Limited paid $28,000 for a new interest in Palantir Technologies during the first quarter. During the first quarter, Manchester Capital Management LLC purchased a new $28,000 holding in Palantir Technologies. In the fourth quarter, Resurgent Financial Advisors LLC purchased a new investment in Palantir Technologies for roughly $28,000. During the first quarter, Laffer Tangler Investments purchased a new investment in Palantir Technologies for roughly $36,000. Finally, During the first quarter, HHM Wealth Advisors LLC increased its holdings in Palantir Technologies by 1,510.9%. HHM Wealth Advisors LLC now owns 4,446 shares of the company's stock, valued at $38,000 after purchasing 4,170 more shares in the last quarter. Institutional investors and hedge funds hold 31.57% of the stock. Investors holding PLTR and active Twitter users are displaying remarkable confidence in the imminent bullish movement of Palantir's stock. They are eagerly anticipating a surge, and their anticipation is palpable. Interestingly, when confronted with tweets that criticize the stock or predict a bearish future, these enthusiasts swiftly respond with comments denouncing them as lies. It is quite intriguing to observe their unwavering faith in their investment, as they seem resolute in maintaining their optimistic outlook, regardless of any negative sentiment expressed. To sum it all up, we are bullish and so are most traders. Palantir Technologies has proven again and again that the company knows how to deliver good returns to its investors, unlike most companies in modern times that only focus on playing around and buying luxury mansions at the cost of investor health. Remember that this is not financial advice and you should always do your own research and make informed investment decisions. That was all for today. Let us know if you think this stock will make you rich or not in the comment section. Hit like and subscribe to our channel $1 World for more such penny stock videos, and we will see you in the next one.